Sad news tonight that leading Manx TT racer Danin has died following fatal injuries sustained at the Churchtown section of the course. Good morning, everyone. A warm welcome to St. Danin's for the service of Holy Communion, um, and particularly this week, incredibly poignant with the loss of uh, Dan Neen, um, local guy, as we know. Um, and um, we remember now and in our prayers later on um, all those affected by uh, that incident. At TT, death's very much at the forefront. It's, it's a very prevalent shadow throughout racing. Most people won't talk about it until it happens. We can't eradicate suffering and death. You know, so we've got to deal with it. There's a balance in sharing grief. And it's the opportunity then for people to talk about death and what it means in human life. The Islam land is linked to land. It's due to get underway now. Ride safely, guys. Enjoy yourselves. Thank you. Control out. The legacy ride on the Alaman happens every year and it's a lap around the TT cost. It's a community remembering everybody who's died. And actually what we do when we do these memorial things, we bring those people back, not physically, but in mystery and you know, with some ethereal quality, back into the space in between us. There's some comfort in that, rather than just a total loss, I think. Dan's family, they wouldn't have wanted the racing to stop because Dan wouldn't have wanted it to stop. People say, how can it happen? How can we let this happen? The riders love it. That's as simple as they love it. And you ain't gonna take that out of them. We are rattled, you know. Now, how can you not be rattled? We've, we've all lost a, you know, a, a racer and a gentleman and a friend in that, but you've got to go out and you've got to put that behind you. From the outside looking in, it looks like how disrespectful, but it's the opposite. We all ride for each other. We will all continue for all our lost friends. Everybody understands, that's probably the, the, the biggest thing. So, because they understand, they, 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 they help and do whatever it takes to kind of make that bad situation as less bad as it can be. You know, I've lost some quite a few friends, really, in, in motorcycles, through motorcycles, and I always look to the sky and um, speak to my friend who, who he died when we were 18 on a, on a road bike, a car pulled out on him. We grew up together, you know, and kind of shared the dream, so that's kind of why I speak to him, because I know he'll be watching and uh, enjoying it with me. I just want to do him proud, I suppose.